Hey guys, Jerk here from Addictive Tips, and in this video, we are talking about how to install Signal for the Linux desktop. So, I'm on the Flatpak page, you know, Flat Hub, where you can install lots of different programs on Flatpak, and the reason for that is uh, I'm installing Signal the Flatpak way because I'm not using Ubuntu currently, I'm using Manjaro, and uh, on the official website for Signal, they only really have instructions for Debian based distributions. So really, this is the best way to demonstrate for, for, for the most amount of users, you know. So what you want to do is you want to go to flathub.org and you want to check the link in the description and follow that. You'll learn how to set up Flatpak. Then you're going to open up a terminal and go back to your web browser and just search for Signal. Now once you're at Signal, you can click on the search result and you can scroll down. Now you can click the install button and this will open it up in KDE Discover. Uh, where is it? Discover. Uh, I don't have it installed. KDE Discover, which uh, is the KDE application that you would get on this desktop, or you get it in GNOME software. But uh, I prefer to use the terminal, so I'm just going to copy this command here, and then I just need to do this command, and I enter my password, press the Y button, press Y again, and let it download and install from Flathub. And this will take a bit of time, but it'll get there. All right, so it's going to go through and download. And now it'll just go through uh, and install the program and uh, get other files that we need. You know, there's lots of different little bits of data that it needs, uh, you know. So basically just be patient and let it go through. Uh, and uh, we will have our signal application which we can run for the first time and the reason you would run it for the first time with a command is because as you install a flat pack on most uh, desktops that aren't GNOME it'll take a bit of time to show up in your applications menu and uh, usually you'll have to reboot or something for it to show up correctly like it should so that's why they provide the command so that you can get it going right away. And what we can do is we can go to the terminal, we can enter our run command, and we should be able to access Signal. And now I can scan this QR code with my phone because the way Signal works on the desktop is you have to link it to your phone to sign in. It's safer that way. And I'm showing you this QR code. I do not have a Signal account, and I do not, you know, plan to because I use something else but if I wanted to it's really nice to know that I can get it installed this way so anyways uh, this is how to install signal on the Linux desktop if you needed this application now you know how to get it and uh, please check the link in the description for all of the information about Flatpak and all of that and I will see you guys in the next video